Right, okay, we're back with circuit B. So this is another simple home circuit you can do. And this one has a minimum of three exercises, but I'm gonna give you an option of a fourth one in case the third one's not really working for you. So same thing, keep everything simple. Half a minute of work, other half a minute rest. The three exercises are going to begin with holding your kitchen sink close enough so that your elbows are a little bit bent. Take a step back, bend both knees, staying tall with your chest, and keep your eyes ahead looking at something on the horizon. If you got a window in front of you, pick something out the window that you can look at. And you're just gonna go 30 seconds like this and just alternate legs. And then you're gonna rest for 30 seconds. Second one, you can sit or stand, whatever you prefer. You're going to take the handle of your detergent jug in one hand and sort of cradle the rest of it with your other hand. Make sure you keep your feet wide for support and you're going to press up and overhead. From the side, just make sure it's not here. You want it more closer to vertical. Bring it down to your chest, back up. Okay, that is your overhead press with the jug. Third one is going to be, you're going to hold the, the molding in a, any doorway, feet close to the doorway, back, pull yourself up, lean back, pull yourself up. And you're pulling with both arms, so it's going to be a pretty even weight distribution on both arms. Um, in case that doesn't feel like it's doing any work for you, that is the simpler one. The fourth option that's a little bit more tiring perhaps is just pick one stair in your household. We're going to pretend this is the banister. And you're just going to do it nice easy up, up, down, down. 30 seconds. And then switch to 30 seconds with the other foot coming up first. So right, left, right, left. And then left, right, 